finally help now. Okay. Let's take all these clothes. Yes. A grognak costume. Hell yeah. Okay, I made that guy naked. Nice. It's a prop. It's a prop, okay. I can't believe I did that. I was like, okay, I'm gonna do this a certain amount of times. And I know I'm not gonna get him. There's also one of these things here, isn't there? I, I can use my uh, worst gun now. There we go. Let's read this. Okay. Days before the war. Or, or the bombs. The fallout, whatever. <sighs> okay, they're all talking about Grognak and whatnot. So I can't be asked for that. It's got nothing to do with the fallout. I didn't mean to pick up all those comics. Oh well. Well I'm done here aren't I? Oh hello. Oh wait what? Oh, I can just jump down. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What's this? The unstoppables. Won't be able to hack this. No, I won't. Okay, now I can actually go to um, find Valentine, or whatever that guy's first name was. Take his stuff, thank you very much. Thank you. Appreciate it. Oh! Bloody hell. You say that like you haven't been here since. Have you literally just been staying at Sanctuary Hills the whole time? Get it. Literally, loads of things are in this location. I'm Hello. telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we ever made. Look at this place. They're ghouls. I still say Malone's weak. He caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Oh, 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 oh. I want to get in here and steal that guy's stuff. Rubbish. Rubbish. I want that suit. Probably have it to be fair. What's this thing got to say then? Purchase tickets. I regret to inform you that your station will be closing due to a purchase agreement with Voltec. Ah, 
bomb tech. Typical. Well, at least they were correct, weren't they? Sweet. Huh? Not tight. Damn, there's some nice stuff in here. Oh, wait. There's a few people outside, damn. other people somewhere downstairs I think talking about are they all ghouls oh no oh I thought my weapon broke I thought it just switched out to the shotgun everyone wearing like 50s clothes in this game instead of like actual armor uh oh oh I can level up I, I forgot let's get some endurance going just because yeah, I seem to really need that recently Some nice aim. Well, that's everyone dead. You okay, Codsworth? Hey. What is it, sir? Your thoughts? All this fuss over it. Oh, I've that was heard all of I had. that. Oh, I can sleep here. Yes, please. there be some Nuka-Cola in these machines? No. And no. Typical. Alright, a train station. It's reminding me of Fallout 3 quite a lot. Those train stations in Fallout 3 were scary. Honestly. It felt like I was playing a horror game. Although I was actually playing it in the in pitch black and my own, not on a live stream. <laughs> Alright, one more guy. Alright, Cosmo seems to have taken care of this guy. Oh, 
Yeah, it's the vault. That's right. And I can just access it because I've got a pit boy. It's a special vault tech pit boy, though, to be fair. Thank you for letting me in. Damn it, I hate it when they open the door. Why is that thing so loud? Hello? Is that you, Skinny? Huh? I like Oh, I can't close it. It's on over here. Can't see! At all! Bloody hell, you've got to wear armor. Oh, oh. There we go. Got it. What is in these little cans? Property of vault -Tec. Yeah, yeah, okay, vault -Tec. that's Gummy Corporation. Ooh, what's it gonna say at this? Welcome employees. After many months of preliminary construction, we are pleased to welcome members of the technical and scientific team to Vault 111. No, 114. Like you, we are excited to just get started on our latest endeavor. Of this, we'll be seeing a lot of civilization, civilian traffic. Okay, Ooh, science staff only. It's probably going to be talking about the tests, the projects that they did on these people. Is it? I've always got to find a quest marker and then it, so it isn't the end. Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? This place is like the opposite of airtight. Because they weren't planning to use it, you oh. oh, oh, oh no. Oh, that was a close one. Blimey, you scared me. I thought you were one of those geezers. He did the mash. He did the insta mash. The insta mash. The bombs went off in a flash. Sup, man. I don't need to do that. Why was that guy holding a baby rattle? That's some real questions that science can't answer. Okay, this guy's strong. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, you win, not yet, haha, <laughs> joking, yeah, you don't get to win. Oh, I'm dead, not dead, hurting apparently. Apparently, like, I found out you could do this in Fallout 3. I tried it out, but 
no, the Fallout 4 one just looks much more weird. He did the mash. I'm gonna say that every time I see Insta Mash now. Is that it? No, there's some light bulbs and screwdrivers here. No, there's more. Hell yeah. That's it. They're all dead. I'll read that the terminal in my free time. Oh, am I not in Vault 114 yet? Oh, I'm actually not, am I? Because it wasn't a separate location going into that vault. How you doing in there, Valentine? Feeling hungry? Want his hand? Have I got a sniper? I've got a laser musket. Oh, I remember this. I used it in the Operation Anchorage DLC. Well, that's not gonna work. I am supposed to kill Dino, right? gun. There we go. Come all this way, risk life and limb for an old private eye. Hang on, you're a robot. Hmm. My son, Sean, is missing. He was kidnapped, but I don't know who took him or where they went. Missing kid, huh? Well, you came to the right man, if not the right place. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame. And she's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. Okay. Uh... This is the Overseer's Terminal. Hustled out of the old neighborhood by bigger don't know what happened to the previous owners, but they're not exactly around to charge rent. Empty vault. Perfect hideout. Aren't all the vaults empty now? Go on then. Alright, fine, follow me. Yeah, I haven't got the right one open. Let me just use a stim pack. Oh no. Do 
that again. Bloody hell. Does Codsworth not want to help? There we go. Mr. Jacob. Mr. Jacob did not nick anything good except the ammo, which is really good actually. Oh, speaking of 10mm pistols, I think I've got enough ammo that will be good enough for this. Yeah. Hello. Let's keep going. Loud, huh? Well, it gets the job done. Too bad for whoever cleans up the floors. Uh, no one. The doors on the fritz. Let me see if I can get it open. Why do we go out the way I can? Oh, right. Because we were all the way down there. There we are. Hell of a lot easier to do when the lock isn't on the other side. How convenient. What's that? Gather a thousand resources used for crafting. Cool. Well, we can sleep here, can't we? No? Uh... Mr. Codsworth. Oh, I thought you were... Well, it's nothing like the maths block we had in school. Oh, hello. Okay, this pistol is OP. Okay, okay, I stand corrected. Uh, is it not, then? Oh my god, I got sent all the way back here. Keep your eyes open. Hard and loud, huh? Well, it gets the job done. Too bad for whoever cleans up the floors. Yeah, that is too bad, isn't it? Uh, let's see if we can. You know what? I, I want to have the saving Pit Boy be like every time I enter the Pit Boy. I don't know what that means. Doors on the but fridge. whatever. Let me see if I can get it open. There we are. Hell of a lot easier to do when the lock isn't on the other side. Oh right, I've already got the achievement, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, you blocked that, sneaky boy. This cigarette, I can just take that, okay. Let's get some sleep, okay. Oh, hello. I think I got in the way of your schedule while I was sleeping. Oh, I'll take your squirrel bits. Oh, sorry, thought you were an enemy.
Okay, let's get some more sleep. Is this the right? Nope, okay. More stairs. More stairs, let's go. Bloody hell. Oh man, I'm shooting your head. Why are you not dying? Oh, I thought you were behind there. More sleep! Love sleeping, it's just free health. Skinny Malone and the rest of his boys are waiting for us somewhere. The name's uh, ironic, but don't let that fool you. I'm assuming he's very fat. Another locked door. Shouldn't be too far. Oh, I'll take that. Okay, I got it. But I hear big fat footsteps on the other side. Step through this door, get ready for anything. Alright, let's do it. What are you doing? You come into my house, shoot up my guys? You have any idea how much this is gonna set me back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two timing dame, Skinny. You gotta tell her to write home more often. Oh, poor little Valentine. Ashamed you got beat up by a girl. I'll just run back home to death. Shall I? Should have left that alone, Nikki. This ain't the old neighborhood. In this vault, I'm king of the castle. You hear me? And I ain't letting some private dick shut us down now that I finally got a good thing going. I told you we should have just killed him. But then you had to get all sentimental. All that stupid crap about the old times. Dala, I'm handling this. Skinny Malone's always got things under control. Oh yeah. Then what's this guy doing here, huh? You talking Bell about me? Must have brought him here to rub us all out. Darla, listen to me. You have a home to go back to. You don't want to throw your life away with these thugs. Don't you try to confuse me! <sighs> Get him, Skinny! Okay. You asked for it. Dialogue being a little bit louder, or maybe the music just being a little bit quieter. It's going to be an awkward conversation with Darla's parents when I tell them their daughter bit the big one. Well, at least the case is closed. Let's get out of here. There's a service ladder that should take us right to the surface. Oh yeah, isn't that what this is? Oh, no. Can I? Oh. Bye! Did that not? Oh, okay. Boring! Sneaky doors, okay. I like your style. Oh, that's a death claw. Death claws look weird in Fallout 3. They've just got some weird mouths. Never thought anything so naturally ominous could end up looking so inviting. I'm not going to lie, it's, it looks like a pretty normal How sky. You know where to find me anyway? Not many people knew where I went. Uh, what Just, are you? What are you, Nick? You really don't know? I'm a synth. Synthetic man. All the parts, minus a few red blood cells. 
I got built, I got old, I got tossed. Then I opened up that little agency in Diamond City, and turns out people have plenty of problems to solve. Now, you mentioned something about your son, Sean, and how he went missing. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. Okay. I'll meet you there. See you in Diamond City. I thought we were going to talk about that now, but alright, guess not. Uh, is that the way to Diamond? Okay, whatever. I'm fast traveling there because I'm smart. Alright, we're getting so we're getting our little uh, uh little things down. I, I don't know what I was saying there. Yes. So thirsty. Oh, hello. Doctor says I can't drink liquor no more. Cola. Need a new Coca-Cola. Who's Sheffield? Hey, you're the new guy, right? Yeah. The new guy? Word kind of travels fast in Diamond City. What can I say? Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. I'll think about it. Hey, no rush. Mm hmm. Yeah, can't be us right now. This place is like an actual city. You don't really get many of those in Fallout. Are you here? Nick? Oh, hello. Oh, God. It's really you. <laughs> well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> You keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. Hey, happy to do it. Yeah? Go diving into scary pre-war ruins all the time then, do you? Here, I know an amount Kinda. wasn't on the table when you went out to find him, but you deserve a reward. Plus a little something extra. I do. You know, if you're looking for work and I don't mind putting on something extra. Hat, He's talking about the fedora. Sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. <laughs> I look so when stupid. You're trying to find on. someone who's gone missing. The devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It, it was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. There's a lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. What else can you tell me? There was a man and a woman. There was a woman? They didn't say much. But I remember they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team. Professionals. The kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Not sure what the backup means, though. Anything else you remember? We're looking for my son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Yeah, I had this game spoiled for Why me. I know that Sean isn't good less than a year old in Why this. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Hmm. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the Gunners, and of course there's the Institute. The gunners? Who are the gunners? I, I know about all the other ones. No job too brutal. They're in the running as likely suspects. They wouldn't be the ones pulling the strings. So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. 
Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself. A discarded prototype, anyway. Don't lie to me, Nick. You're one of them. They made you. Yeah. There wasn't a question mark after that, okay. You've got something to hide. Blah, blah, blah. But the truth is, people smart enough to build something like me are smart enough to cover their tracks. And arrogant enough to throw their unwanted trash into the Commonwealth and fend for itself. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? Bold. One of them came right up to me. Bald head. Scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. It can't you didn't be. You hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? Oh my god, that's an awesome name. <laughs> Who is it? Do you think he has Sean? Hmm. Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned West Stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. It's not Sean, it can't There's be. no way that could be Sean. Yeah. Big difference between an infant and a ten-year-old, but that doesn't mean we're on the wrong track. He could have a son of his own. Or maybe he's turned kidnapping into a bad habit. In any event, they both vanished a while back. No trace. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two oh. should still be careful. Where's the camera going? I always am. Nice. You always am. Alright, I guess I'm following you, but I can't really do that. I need to sell a lot of those guns that I collected. Hello. I didn't want Ellie to hear this, but I think you should know. Everything I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance? Bad news. He's more than just a mercenary. Oh, He's a on. professional. No Quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies, because they're all dead. Except you. Nine to one odds says he's our man. More than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The M.O. is all him as well. Leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later? Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that off. Is that it? Is that all you have to say? Where are we going again? I I'm just following you into this room. Oh, we're in a stadium. That's pretty cool. Here we are. Keep an eye out, will you? See if I can get this open. That's one heck of a lock. Something to hide, Kellogg? Why don't you give it a try? Y are you taking the mic? Lock's really strong. Nick. Stubborn lock, ain't it? See that platform in the distance? Near the city entrance? That's the elevator to the mayor's office. Why don't you go ask around there? I'll stay here and see if I can jimmy this lock. Alright. Well, I guess I'm just gonna have to walk all the way there, so this will take some time, won't it? Unless... <laughs> Shortcuts. I keep hearing some like weird noise. I can't tell if is that. The... I don't know what it is. Heard you rescued Valentine. Good work. Thank you. Don't sense scare the hell out of me. But Nikki, he ain't like those institute psychos. No, that's true. You still carrying that old handmaid around? I'm telling you, 
the grip on that thing is just going to fall off one of Cola. these days. Look, Cola. Yeah, so far. You think I'm just gonna buy a new gun because of a bad grip? Who's talking about a new gun? I can sell you a properly machined gun. Hello. You? I, I don't know you. Just keep your distance. I want to shut up. Keep calm. I'm standing still. That's exactly what a synth would say. But I don't know. Are you really uh, human? Uh, no. No, not human at all. I knew it. Get away from my stall, you synth. We don't serve you things here. Myrna. I said we don't serve your kind here, you synth. Trying to tell me you're human now? I'm human. human as the day I was born. Well, you do look human enough. But I'll be watching you. I have eyes like a... Well, they're good eyes. Got it? Chilling in the pinnacles. Got these pokeballs around. At least I Where hope I heard that? a noise. And now I think I have found. Hey, wait. Wasn't that ball over there just a second ago? I don't think I'm alone. I think I'm intruding someone's 